Well, in Europe and uh, probably across the world, migraine needs more uh, effective and tolerable drugs. The ones that we have now were not um, thought for migraine. We found out that they were good preventive treatments for migraine in a way by chance. And uh, right now we need drugs that are focused and target uh, disease specifics and that are more tolerable. Many patients drop out from oral prevention because of um, you know, side effects and um, so yeah, we need, these are the needs of, for migraine prevention I guess. Erenumab is uh, a monoclonal antibody against uh, the CGRP or the receptor for CGRP. And what is CGRP? CGRP is a protein. We call it, you know, uh, calcitonin gene relate, related uh, protein. But it's a protein that we've proven since many years that it elevates itself during a migraine attack and that is elevated constantly in these people that have many, many migraine attacks. We call them either, you know, uh, uh, high frequent episodic migraineurs or chronic migraine. Um, so what Erenumab is trying to do is to lower, you know, the, the amount of effect that CGRP has during uh, migraine attacks. Erenumab is administered sub-Q, subcutaneously, uh, in a monthly dose. It's very practical um, and it facilitates adherence because uh, patients don't have to remember that they have to take it at home. So I think it can be you know, promising in that aspect. In my opinion, um, this, the positive uh, CHMP you know, from the EMA has been uh, probably the best news that Europe has had in prevention in the last years. Um, it means that uh, they value that the drug can be you know, put for further evaluation at EMA and it's a further step uh, within getting a final approval at the end. Erenumab was, has been approved uh, for, you know, already by the FDA for migraine prevention in general. So, um, you know, the answer is migraine. Every migraine patient that has uh, the indications for prevention, not every patient should get prevent preventive treatment, but those that need preventive treatment um, would be, you know, potential targets.